Hey guys, this is Rahul and you're welcome to gomahamaya.com and in this beautiful tutorial, we are going to learn how to import templates from Elementor library and how to save templates as well as section template in your Elementor library. Even we are going to learn how to insert templates and export templates from your own library. So for importing templates, you have to click on add templates and you'll get redirected to pages. So these are the popular templates you have. Some most of them are pro versions, but you can select the free versions out of them. You can make a filter new trend populars. These are the filters for our templates. If you have already created any templates, you'll find your templates inside my templates. So we haven't saved anything. So it's blank. Now, I'll go back to the pages and there, let's say I need this free template. So I'll click on insert. So for insertion, you have to connect the template library from Elementor and you'll get redirected to this page. You have to click on get started and now you'll get redirected to the login page of the Elementor. You have to enter your email ID and the password. If you don't have, click on create account. And there you have to write the email ID and password. Then you should click on login. And now you are connecting your site with the Elementor login dashboard. So I avoid selecting this option because they are like taking uh, some of the data from our website to improve their services. I don't want them to take my data from my websites. Either it's a small data or the medium data. I won't allow them. So I'll click on connect. And if you scroll down, you can see our templates is imported now. You can edit on any of the sections and make editing. Let's say select this and edit the text inside that or the image you have. Go ahead and make editing. Now guys, we'll learn how to save a template in your Elemental library. So for saving the template, you have to hover over that publish option and beside that you'll find a save options. You have to click on the save options and you have to click on save as templates. That means you are going to save the complete page as a template in your library. So I'll write down some name. Let's say complete page. Okay. And I'll click on save. And now if, if you look here, you can see total four kinds of things here. Number one, preview, then insert. Here you have options. If you click in this area, you'll find delete or export options. To import, you have options this one. You have to click on import and then import template. Before we learn export and import, we have to learn one more thing that is how to save sections, how to save that particular section. This is the complete template you are savings. So I'll cancel this. And now once you are in this area, you have to first select the sections. Let's say so for that we have to select the sections and once it gets selected there, if you'll hover over it will automatically get selected. You'll find this edit sections option there. You have to right click on that. And once you'll right click, you'll find save as a template options. So now you are saving that particular sections. Let me tell you again, this particular section is started from there till this part you are saving. So I'll again click right click there and I'll save as template. Now I'll say something, the name of that, the name of that section is something. I just simply wrote the name and now we'll learn how to insert it and we did correctly or not. We'll verify. So I'll cancel it and I'll go down and here I'll say add templates. I'll go to my templates and this something I want to insert. Okay, so I'll click on insert. It will ask you say yes. And you need to wait some five to 10 seconds depending upon your website speed. Now, if you'll scroll down, you can see the same content appears here, which was there on the top. The same content appear below, which was there on the top. Now, let me cancel it and I'll click down here. And uh, now, we will learn how to export the template. Let's say we have a template which says something. 
so i'll click here and i'll click on export and they're asking me to change you made have not been saved so make sure you have clicked here publish one or saved one save as a draft if you want to save as a draft you have to click there this area this sections and then you uh you can you won't get this notification i'll say leave no problem download this export first so you will see that export got downloaded in this area now i'll delete this something again okay let's go to this import option and there you can click here to select the file or you can drag and drop in this area if you'll drop it here it will get imported directly and now again click on insert so you'll see our teaching section again got inserted i hope you find this video useful if you did give thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for the more further updates thank you